Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're here with Ivana again, and we're gonna be doing a chit chat. Get ready with me. So okay, we're just gonna get start. straight into it. So first, I'm gonna go in with my Tatcha Gold Lip Spun Chopstick, and it is light. Mm -hmm. So I I'm just gonna. Mm, I don't know what to do. Oh, okay. I'm gonna start off with my Mac Martin Times. Is already my favorite thing to do? Just like soak myself in. Do you want some of that? Oh yeah. Yes, queen. Oh, look, I have my Avion. Oh, this is kind of stupid because I like paid, what, $10 for water, but. I actually got these new um, primers and I actually really like them. Uh, one's like an instant touch up from Givenchy and the other one's like just a regular primer for all skin types. So I'm gonna go with this one because, yeah. I need to do my full blend in a touch up girl. Okay, I'm just gonna go with my Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. I love Is that them. good? I yeah, it is. It really is. But honestly, I have really big pores, so I always mix it with the professional primer. It's like, <gasps> let's see. Shut up, I ran out. It's so good. Because I have big pores in like my T zone. Girl, I think we all do. Yeah. So I'm also using the professional just around my T-zone like she This really modifies everything. Actually, I'm gonna go in with brows first. Brows, Ooh. I'm gonna do precisely my brow pencil by Benefit. And I'm just gonna do a little bit. I'm gonna do like a really natural look. Are you going full then? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm doing full coverage, but I don't wanna put on like eyeshadow. No, no, I don't. That. I just like to look like very cunty. I'm just like, gonna do this like and like kind of don't talk to me. Stay in your lane. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm going for today. So now I'm gonna be going in with my Lancome foundation. This is life. So I put two pumps. You know your brows? Is that you have like really nice brows already? Yeah. They're like filled in. No. They're just thick. <laughs> no, not filled in, like they're like yeah, natural. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna use my Unicorn Essence on my Lancome foundation. And these are life. Thank you for Solly for literally being invented. Mm. So just to, like shake things up a little bit while we're doing our makeup, I wanna play a game and it's we're gonna would you rather. We're gonna do would you rathers. We're about to make this. Okay, so I like to use the Unicorn Essence on my foundation because it makes it more moist and it like applies, it adds antioxidants and oils so that it applies more evenly, so. I'm gonna do kind of like a body natural look. A body natural look. A body look. natural look. Okay, would you rather be forced to wear wet socks for the rest of your life or be allowed to wash your hair only once a year? Hmm. <laughs> Oh, we're on like the BuzzFeed hardest would you rather, by the way. Be forced to wear wet socks. For the rest of your life or not be able to wash your hair for a year. Okay. This is really hard, but I think feet are really weird, but also people see your hair every Do you have like time. a weird, like for me, I don't understand people have like a foot fetish. That's like, disgusting. I think feet are gross. Shut up, someone on Snapchat literally used to be like, can I see your feet? <gasps> That's disgusting. I'm not even That's kidding. Gross. That's so weird. I'm gonna, I don't know if I already said this, but I'm gonna use the Fenty foundation. I love Fenty, especially for like that natural matte look. And I have oily skin, like my skin type is really oily. Fenty is really good. I actually was gonna be doing a Fenty with you because I got it like the first week it came out, but I was taking a break from YouTube. I think it was necessary. Also, I look really funny, so. <laughs> I just, like a lot of people have been saying how Fenty it has dries to. like your skin really fast, but it does dry your skin really it fast. It does, but I have oily skin, so can't relate. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. And like they say, how if it's in your skin for too long, it's like really hard to blend it out and stuff like that. Um, but That's honestly, like just work in parts. Is. But work in parts. You gotta work it in your skin. Would you rather wear someone else's dirty underwear or use someone else's toothbrush? That one's easy, toothbrush. 
True. Toothbrush. Your, your mouth already has so many germs. You yeah. Smell, so. I mean, it's true. The mouth has so much bacteria. Yeah, but like, someone's dirty underwear is disgusting. disgusting. It's really gross. Like, no, I don't want your genitalia in your mouth. <laughs> okay. Alright, next. Would you rather ship bricks? <laughs> Would you rather ship bricks or puke slugs? Puke <gasps> slugs. Actually, that's disgusting. That's so gross. Oh no, I can't. Actually, I think I'm gonna go into <gasps> ship bricks. The ship bricks hurt. Okay, next. Would you rather pee yourself in public once a week or shit yourself? <laughs> Or shit yourself in private daily. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> shit myself in private. But, but daily? <laughs> right? like, I actually. Daily? Wait, I go. And honey, if you want to shit breaks and that's happening once a day. Once a day. Oh no. That hurts. Okay, I definitely don't think I'd go with the shit breaks, but also, you think slugs, they're probably like crawling in your face. I know, but still, that, like, I'm not gonna do that to shit break. Like, I can't. <laughs> That's just weird. Next. Would you rather always have to tell the truth or always lie? Always lie. <laughs> always lie. Honestly, because- Oh wait, shit. But then when, what if you're like trying to tell the truth and like you actually care about the truth And then like no one can't. talks to you because you're always lying. <laughs> yeah. <gasps> okay, I'd rather always tell the truth in that case. But what if you're like in some like- Deep sketch, shit. Sketchy shit and you have to lie? Like- yeah, because I've gotten myself out of like really bad situations with like a couple finesses and like they didn't hurt anybody. It's but. like white lies, like you know, yeah, like, you know what? Like, it's like, like if, someone, if someone has like a really ugly outfit and you don't want to tell them, like that's like a white lie and you're like, oh no, you look cute. <laughs> but see, that's a little mean because like as a friend. No, yeah, no, but, but it doesn't also, have to not, be a friend. Yeah, no, no, it no. Because no. with friends, I'm kind of real, but like if it's like a random I feel like that's so mean girls. I feel like that's so mean girls though, like saying like, oh, I like your bracelet or whatever and it's like, ew. Like, I don't know. That's so many people I know. <laughs> okay, so for concealer, I'm going to use a Tarte Shape Tape. I am obsessed with this one. And for concealer, I'm going to use the YSL under eye illuminator. I'm just gonna put a little bit because this is so full coverage and I kind of want that natural look. I'm in love with this concealer. Okay. This concealer makes me look like a Barbie doll. Am I missing? <laughs> <laughs> I heard really, really good things about it. No, it's really good. My mom first started using it and then a couple of my friends were like, you need to try it. So I gave it a twirl, a little test drive, and I liked it. <laughs> yes, yeah, so honestly, Tarte Shape Tape have, has been in the market like for so long, and it was one of those things that I was like, no, I don't want to try it. Like it's probably overhyped. It's not overhyped. It's hyped just enough because yeah, it's literally. amazing. You know they DM me the other day. <gasps> and it's amazing. It honestly, is really it's good. A really good product. Okay, I'm in love with this beauty blender, people. It's not like a regular beauty sponge. Um, I literally now search for ones that are like double-sided, one for the eye, one for the other side, and it just works amazingly. I started getting the Real Technique brushes because it's honestly the same thing, if not better, as a beauty blender, and it's so much like less inexpensive, it's so much more affordable, and honestly, and I hate replacing beauty blenders. It's it, annoying. And honestly, I can afford. I can, yeah. And I always like have to rebuy beauty blenders and stuff like that. Because like I, within two months. Exactly. Because after you wash them for a certain like amount of time, they start like just, peeling. Like this yeah. is my second stupid Givenchy beauty blender, and the last time it like peeled off. But also, if you're like washing it often. Oh. Pause. Hello. Also, something I want to talk about, I think that it's really important to use a beauty blender when you're applying powder because I used, I just got this hourglass brush and it's really good to like settle in foundation and stuff, but the second I put it into my setting powder, it literally goes everywhere and it doesn't even apply to my face. 
So that's something else. Beauty Blender is really only powder brushes. All right, so to set my face, I'm gonna be using the Tarte Amazonian Clay Finishing Powder, and I got a little, and I got a little sample of this with like my my Sephora points, and I usually use like the Kat Von D setting powder, but um, but we want to try some new stuff. Yeah, and also I kind of like this one better, really? like to be honest. Yeah, when it runs out, I'm definitely gonna buy a new one. I am obsessed with the Laura Mercier powder. It's really good. So we're gonna go in now. I totally forgot about the Would You Rathers. Next. <gasps> Same. Oh my god. Would you rather never have internet access again? Never be able to take an airplane anywhere again? Airplane. Oh, Easy. You, you, could, you takes, could take a cruise. That takes too long. And ew. I'm sorry. But I'm rather not have internet ever again. No, see? But That's maybe it's like not my internet. I could like use some like your internet. No, I think it's like never have yeah. internet again. Cause like then the plane thing would be like you can never get on a jet again. So like yeah, if you have any rich friends, then <laughs> okay. Actually, yeah, the plane thing. Like I literally would rather go on a cruise ship or take a boat. Or literally, helicopters are faster than planes. If you didn't know that. So mm -hmm. so something we have to talk about. Tart. No, don't go there. Okay, so something don't we have to there. talk about? Don't go there. What? We're gonna talk about like the foundation how they didn't do a rainbow. No, I'm not gonna talk about that. But now we're including this in the video because it's funny. <laughs> <laughs> something you have to talk about. This YSL concealer does not conceal pimples really well. It's really just for like applying to areas you want to just brighten. The tart is more for like hiding pimples, doing that kind of thing, and also for under the eye. So And for highlight, it's big on highlighting. True. Wait. So to, for bronzer, I'm going to use a Marc Jacobs um, bronzer in the color Tantric, I think, in 102. I need a new Netflix show to watch. Ooh, um, I just finished. It's called Money Heist, but it's also called Casa de Papel in Spanish. And yes, it's in Spanish. If you don't like Spanish, goodbye. Oh. There's the door. I mean, we live in Miami, so if you don't know Spanish, that's kind of weird. Kind of weird, yeah. I mean, you're not really dead. Okay, so the contour needs to be strong if you're trying to. Another woman's man. Like, like natural. Like, now that I'm looking, it literally looks white under my eyes. Like, I kind of like it. it no, it's good. It's like a highlight. Yeah. Okay. Would you rather find true love or win the lottery? Scooch. Okay, well, my true love um, has to be rich, so my true love. <laughs> Alright then. <laughs> what about you? We can get both. Um, I'd rather find true love because money doesn't necessarily make you happy. I think. Like, there's a lot of millionaires that are like depressed or like they have like. Yeah, because when you search for really happiness bad. outside of yourself, you don't find it. You tell them. There you go. You tell them. Okay, so for blush, I'm gonna use the Tarte Concept Amazonian Clay um, blush. Yeah, the name is Concept. So, I'm just gonna put that in my cheeks. So, this was Color Sunlight, and this is beautiful. <laughs> Sorry. $50,000? Yeah, but sometimes we have four times bonus if you buy the special product. Okay. 
セクニング Okay, so just to like brighten them. Also, I think I'm gonna be reviewing all the Farsali stuff all in one. If you guys think that's a good idea, comment down below. But this highlighter is so fing cool. I want that natural glow. You know what? Look, it's literally jelly. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's crazy. You know what I wanna mix that with? The skinny dip um, Kylie Jenner face duo. I don't know why, it's so good. Like, the, <gasps> it's super good. <laughs> This, literally, you need this much. Like, not even a dot. It is crazy. I'm not gonna go crazy on my nose contour. I'm just gonna, like, pass the brush over. I don't want anything insane. This is already insane. Let me see the first color. Stop, it's actually, it's actually jelly. It's <gasps> insane. Look at this highlight, though. Oh my god, he's on the nose. Okay, Jeffree Star. Yeah, we're going crazy, Jeffree. James, Manny, all got the beard. We're all gonna be friends. <laughs> I'm kidding, hopefully, you know. Who knows where they will take me? I also, for a while, was a really scared to make videos, but now I'm like, I'm fucking Wait, shit. Oh, this is such like a pretty glow. But honestly, I've never been too like, you know, like intense highlight. Yeah, no, I kind of like my highlight to be a little subtle, like just bring me together. Shit, also, I took a little too long. Actually, no crap. Wait, it's like a. Oh, Ooh. oh no, I literally took too long. What? What'd you do? <laughs> to blend, so like, is it really more? You have really nice eyelashes. And then with like a fan brush, I'm gonna grab the Kylie Jenner highlighter and just put it on top of the jelly highlighter. Ooh, first I'm gonna grab that Fix Plus. Bam, bam, bam. <laughs> Honestly, YouTube's so fun. Okay. Okay, now we're gonna go in with that. I'm gonna put that on top of the jelly. The trick with highlighter is just to like pop out the areas where the sun actually hits your face. Yeah. So that's why it's like in the it's upper like up cheek. It's like up here. In your forehead a, a little, little bit. A little bit here. Not that much. That much. Um, sometimes I like to do my jawline just because like... And some people like to do, I think it's blush. But I like the highlighter just because it's like... And it's more natural. And then obviously here... It's like kind of... Alright, so... I'm already on my last step. Catch up mascara. No, I don't use that. You don't use mascara? No, mm -hmm. beautiful. Okay, so. Who needs fake lashes when you got real lashes? For lipstick, hmm, should I try this? Oh, my lip. I love doing lip. Okay. Okay, right, for. I'm gonna use a Sephora. I don't know if I should use this color. Also, I'm going back in with my hourglass brush just to finish this up. Oh. Okay. Okay, for lipstick, I'm gonna go in with the Huda Beauty Liquid Matte. Um, I wanna get her new foundation. Lipstick. So, okay, so pick a product. You have between Tatcha, Glam Glow, and Dior. Pick one. Mm, Glam Glow. Good choice. These are awesome. The putt mud, it is life. I haven't opened it in a while, to be real. Okay. 
Okay guys, so be sure to like and subscribe down below and leave a cool comment if you thought something was cool, your favorite product, or if you have a video idea. Also, I'm gonna link her channel down below and also her Instagram down below so you guys can follow her and watch her videos. And I'm also gonna be on her channel a little, so, I actually more like a lot. So, yeah, um, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you later. Stay gorgeous. Oh, I like that. Stay gorgeous. Yeah, because it's Gigi Gorgeous's, but fuck her. Uh. <laughs>